you a big bitch. Uh, and I got your big bitch. What's so, up? Is you no baby? Hey guys, it's you know back to the video. I'm in the bed because I'm not getting in bed for this shit. I'm still watching Millie. So <laughs> I just want to be very clear that no one was surprised by this news that just broke out by the shade room. But let's get into it. So long story short, um, apparently a third eyewitness has brought some tea to the courts and said that um, Toilet is innocent or has proof of his innocence. Again, we've been trying to tell y'all for the longest that we don't believe Megan Thee Stallion. I kept saying so many times that if you put Megan Thee Stallion's IG lives together, you will see that she's a motherfucking liar. Like, girl, you've been trying to up and down to swear that Tori shot you, but my whole thing was from the beginning, how did Tori Lane shoot you and you didn't see because it, it happened behind your back, girl? So how'd you know he shot you, girl? So anyway, let's go to the shade room because they had the tea they pulled up for us. So check this out. Let's be real for a second. Um, Megan has been, again, portraying this whole protect black women shit, okay? We know that. Duh. I'm going to in every video. We know black women are protected. But the way Megan went about it was awesome bullshit, okay? You came out first. You spread the lies. You told that Tori shot you. Again, you didn't see him shoot you, but you had to put on somebody to blame. Tori came out and defended Kelsey saying that she didn't do it. Now, you know, you put out songs in your album. Tori made a whole album talking about the conversation. And we were just going trying to figure out who the fuck was trying to make sense of everything. We didn't know who to believe. We only believed Megan because Megan was the star that said anything first. Now, look. Now, our witnesses came out and said that, hey, we got proof that Tori's innocent. So, yeah, fuck Megan. I mean, it's been fuck Megan the whole time. Megan has had... Not just Tori say that she's a little abusive. You had um, EJ and her ex-boyfriend who got who she got arrested for beating his ass to test the fact that she's crazy as shit. What were we waiting to find out? Yeah, we're tired and, you know, we went for the court date. The court date pushed back twice now. But you know what? Tori does need to fucking speak. I mean, Tori Ben need to motherfucking speak. But Tori now has the right to speak. It's like... Y'all kept trying to hold Tori back to speak because y'all knew if Tori finally said the real truth, you know, Megan would look like a dumbass bitch. And now she definitely like a dumbass bitch because now look, Tori about to speak, Tori about to be innocent, and y'all holding me mad as fuck that y'all sat there and believed Megan all this time. So anybody still believe Megan, you know, didn't get shot or whatever the case may be, now you always got to say now. What you got to say now? Megan was lying. Duh. Fuck. All we were waiting for was someone to finally say they had a witness that Tori was telling the damn truth. Now we got it. So what y'all gonna do now? All the Megan Thee Stallion stands, what y'all gonna do now? Please tell me, because I'm curious, okay? But, anywho, <laughs> like, comment, subscribe, I'll see you next time, because the blondes are gonna fucking run with this shit and put their own narrative they support Megan. So, we're gonna see what happens, but the mob always knows what's up. So, peace.